There are 254 blocks of Broadway in Manhattan, and I decided to draw every one of them. Artist Elise Engler loves Broadway, all 13 miles of it. It took me precisely one year to draw every block. Except I have one more drawing I need to do. I'm basically replacing Stephen Colbert's name with mine. Sorry, Stephen. Day after day, month after month, she turned the streets of Manhattan into her art studio. I had to choose what was interesting to me about each block. Sometimes it was an architectural detail. Sometimes it was an iconic building or doorfront. Of course, New Yorkers are used to seeing just about anything happen on their streets and sidewalks. It was surprising how infrequently people would stop to ask me what I was doing. Nice to meet you. So if you could just get a few shots. On each block, I would hand my camera to someone and ask them to take a picture of me working. So there was a record of me drawing all four seasons. I can see Broadway from my bedroom window. I just look out the window, and there it is. A year on Broadway began after an unfortunate accident on another New York street. For 35 years, I rode a bike everywhere in New York. But on January 30th, 2013, I was hit by a truck. My left arm was badly damaged. It took a long time to recover. But as a result, I started drawing Broadway. A year on Broadway is a walker's drawing. It's about walking the city. Everybody knows Broadway. Angler says she considers her drawings a form of journalism. Riverside Church, the famous Tom's Restaurant right out of Seinfeld. I drew in Times Square at night. It was so bright there that there was enough light to draw by. It is the New York City street. And every now and then, the streets of Broadway. This is my window right there. Leave Elise Engler's studio it's beautiful. to stretch across art gallery walls. I'm thinking about doing it in another city or in a different way, but now that I see the work hanging up, I'm thinking, whoa, I did it. And now what's next?